guys, Jeremy here from School of Wok Covent Garden. It's Wok Wednesdays once again and I'm here to show you a one ton soup. A one ton is a type of dim sum or dumpling. Dim sum actually means a little touch of heart. So this one's for your loved ones. Don't forget to click on the link in the description for the recipe. Right, let's start with the soup. This simple soup starts with ginger and spring onion. You've got to sear your ginger until it's golden brown. Now the trick to this is tempering the ginger. Get all that flavour out of there before you add any liquid. So once your ginger is crisp, around the edges, I'm going to start to sizzle a bit of oyster sauce in. One to two tablespoons of oyster sauce. That's going to be the main flavour of the one ton soup. It's important to cook this oyster sauce for about 10 to 20 seconds and then add your chicken stock. Ooh. And that sort of caramelisation on the bottom of the pan make all the difference to the soup. Pinch of salt. Cover it. All the way. Anywhere between 10 and 20 minutes. Right, so onto the filling. Got some finely chopped ginger and garlic. Spring onion. Again, finely, finely chopped. Coriander to freshen things up. start to chop up some shiitake mushrooms. These have been soaked in hot water overnight. Some Chinese chives, kind of more vegetable like than a western chive, more crunch to them, garlicky in taste. Again, finely chopped. Long, so the trick is cut them in half and then start chopping. Prawns. Cleavers are great for bashing things, anything fibrous like prawns. Gets your stress out. Straight in. So now to make this really traditional, we've got a good mix of minced pork and minced prawn. I would say about 50-50 prawn to pork. We're gonna season this filling up. Classic Chinese marinade. Light soy sauce, sesame oil, and a pinch of sugar. I say one layer of marinade, it's roughly two fingers deep to any size bowl. I'll show you a layer in a second. So this is about four fingers deep, so that's two layers. One layer of light soy sauce, like this. One, two, and then sesame oil. Same, but about half the amount. One, two. We're sticking on two layers, so two good pinches of sugar. And most importantly, when you're mixing this up, use your hands, one hand clean, or one hand clean, one hand dirty. Give it a good massage through. Get all that flavor into every part of that filling. Making your wontons, simpler than it looks. Teaspoon of filling in the center. Dab of water 
over the edges of your pastry. Then you go diagonal over center to center, thumb and push. Index finger to close up one side and then exactly the same on the other side. Squeeze as much air out as possible. Now we pick up your arrow, an arrow pointing downwards. This is what we like to call at School of Walk the Dark Knight Rising. You can see our little sort of Batman is. Once you've got those, sit that on your hand, one small dab of water over one edge, overlap and squeeze from the center up. That's what we call a gold ingot shape. You make your one tons this shape, you're giving people good wealth. Right, so one tons are made. Soup's bubbling away. Got that lovely savory smell. Don't take long to cook. You go straight in to your boiling soup. Bring that to a boil. It takes about three minutes. Look up. The one tons just start to float to the top. You want to give it about 30 seconds from there. Never go anywhere without your School of Walks skimmer. Perfect for skimming out of the soup, letting things drain. They're floating nicely. I can see that chive wanting to jump out of the one ton. Serve this straight up. I've got a family portion here. Top it up with that delicious soup. Garnish, some deep fried shallots. Some nice fresh leaves of coriander. Ooh. None left for the cream. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this Wok Wednesday one ton soup. If you really enjoyed the recipe, don't forget to subscribe and like the video.